So I'm Rob Frysdale, I'm a vet and a consultant, and I'm here today to talk to the farmers and the team about young stock health and early calf health, especially pre-calving through to about eight weeks a week. Also, I came yesterday for the first time actually. The guys sent through all their data, and we had a bit of an analysis session and conference call a couple of weeks ago. And yesterday we met up with the farm vets and the team here to talk through early calf health and, and look at what we're going to talk about today for the farm visit. For those that couldn't attend today, I think the best thing to say is that colostrum is still very key. We were talking mainly about how early calf health is impacted by colostrum management, but looking towards the fact you're taking that early calf and turning that into a milking heifer and the impact of, of disease in the first seven or eight days, uh, how that can affect the long term product productivity and profitability of that animal. Yeah, so the susceptibility triangle is something I think we should get people to think more about, which is how the animal's influenced by its environment by the calf itself, its genetics and its previous health and its colostrum and then by the disease exposure and how the three of those work together to form a sort of triangle with the calf's illness in the middle and how stress is really the main driver for any one of those things overtaking and causing a disease like scour or pneumonia.